Can, 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 can you take your brief as well and, and, and keep it a minute or less? Um, comrades power, comrades power. Now, I want us to trace the bullet that was in David Chege's head. Back to the trigger, to the magazine, to the command, Adamson Bugay, to Jafeth Kome, and we make it very clear where the accountability stops. My point is this, the person who is ultimately responsible for all the death, the destruction, is the president. Okay? Let's not make excuses. Let's not say the police, the police, the police. They are individually culpable. But ultimately, it's the president who takes responsibility. Ruto must go. Ruto must go. As I finish, I think the problem we have, and I'll put this to the panel, I think we have a country that is lacking ideology. And please, civil society, help us define the, the ideology for this revolution. Because you have inherited a system, colonial government, and governments after, where governance is about brutality, repression, plunder, and pillage. So can we have an ideology moving forward so that when we fight, when we occupy spaces, we're occupying spaces knowing the Kenya that we are fighting for is defined by this set, certain set of values. Otherwise, without values, we'll get back, certain politicians will come back, and we'll have the same you know, battle over and over again. Thank you. Ruto must go. All right, can I, can I get ladies in the room, please? Uh, so bring the microphone to the front. Yes. Um, 